Wow, that's not something you see every day. An Australian flag flying outside the Forbidden City. This morning I'm in the heart of Beijing, standing in Tiananmen Square, outside the Great Hall of the People. Inside, Kevin Rudd is in talks with Wen Jiabao, the Chinese Premier. Mr. Rudd, of course, has vowed not merely to raise Tibet with the Premier today, but to urge that China work through dialogue towards a peaceful resolution. Soon after he comes out, there'll be a press conference, and we'll be able to find out how things went. So I'm now in the lobby of the Beijing Hotel, where the Prime Minister is holding his press conference. I'm just waiting for the press party to come back out so I can get the lowdown on what the Prime Minister has said. Looking at the transcript, it seems Mr. Rudd didn't give away a great deal about Wen Jiabao's response. He said merely that what the Premier told him in private about China's approach to Tibet did not really differ from what they have been saying publicly. Encouragingly, the Prime Minister has refused to waver under diplomatic pressure and has stood up for Tibet yesterday stating his concerns publicly, and today repeating them in person to the Chinese Premier. Disappointingly, the Chinese leadership is showing no signs yet of backing down, and no interest in a constructive route forwards. Mm.